Who would have thought? The impromptu dance moves of the retarded boy. To be the king of the world. Back when Elvis was still unknown. Forrest Gump with braces on his legs danced lame for him. But Elvis Presley found inspiration for the dance. He's been on stage ever since. Soon Forrest Gump was old enough to go to school. But because of lack of intelligence. Being rejected by the school. But in the eyes of Forrest Gump's mother. He has an equal opportunity to know the world. After an all-night conversation with the principal. Finally touched each other with sincerity. First day of school at Forrest Gump. Because of the orthotics on your legs. No one wants to sit with a freak. Only this girl named Jenny accepted him. In the eyes of Forrest Gump, Jenny seems to be a beautiful angel. Because except for mom, few people would take the initiative to talk to him. Soon the two became good friends who talked about everything. They played together in their own little world. Only to make a few punks very jealous. To avoid being bullied by bullies. Jenny shouted for Dan to run. Jenny's words are firmly imprinted in Dan's heart. He ran as fast as he could. The gears of fate began to turn. When Adam is completely unbound and running forward. Not even the bikers behind us. Forrest Gump ran through fields, ponds and towns. Finally ran back to Jenny's house. It turns out that Jenny also had an unhappy childhood. The grumpy father only knew how to drink every day. Her mother remarried. Jenny was alone with her father's yelling and beatings. In the end Jenny had to live with her grandmother. Fortunately, Forrest Gump, a good friend, grew up with him. Gangsters would still bully Forrest Gump for years. They even changed cars in order to catch up with Forrest Gump. Forrest Gump can only try his best to run. Accidentally ended up on the college field. And outpaced all the runners. It's a great thing for a football coach. Forrest Gump also got the chance to go to college because of the blessing. Forrest Gump on the field is like a red storm, leaving all his rivals in the dust. I couldn't even stop after I scored. Forrest Gump didn't get it either. How did you become the star of the football team? Even the then president shook his hand. Forrest Gump's college career, although it ended in five years of football, but he still got his bachelor's degree. His mother was very proud of him. After graduation, Forrest Gump chose to enlist in the army. The same scene repeated itself. No one would sit with him, except for this black guy named Barb. Babuga has lived on shrimp for generations. His dream is to own his own shrimp boat. At this time, Forrest Gump does not understand what the dream is. It just feels like army life is so easy. The instructor asked him why he had joined the army. Forrest Gump just said he was following orders. For the simple-minded Dan. Here he doesn't have to think at all. The only thing to do is follow orders. The instructor had practiced assembling firearms. Barb became his only friend in the army. Even though he's always talking about shrimping. But Dan never gets bored. The hardest time is at night. He always misses mom and Jenny. Dan went back to visit Jenny on vacation. I didn't realize Jenny was a bar singer. He was naked with only a guitar to hide his shame. Then a drunk kept harassing Jenny. Forrest Gump saw a good friend being bullied. I went up there and killed two people. The original hero saves the beauty but causes Jenny to lose her job. In the face of Jenny's complaints Forrest Gump said he loved him. We'll take care of him in the future. Can Jenny thinks Forrest Gump does not understand what is love. Just because he never gave up on Forrest Gump. He stopped a car and tried to leave. Then Forrest Gump stopped him. Jenny suddenly saw the light. So Forrest Gump came to say goodbye to himself. After tonight, they don't know if they'll see each other again. He just asked Forrest Gump one thing. Don't try to be brave if you're in trouble. Just run as far away as you can. It is this sentence that will save Forrest Gump's life in the future. After saying goodbye to his mother, Forrest Gump went to war in Vietnam. On the first recon, the company was ambushed. They were pinned down by the opposing fire. The platoon commander could only order a retreat. Forrest Gump remembered Jenny to his charge. He ran ahead without looking back, all the way out of the war zone. Then I realized Bob wasn't out yet, so he went back to save Babu. But he kept running into other wounded soldiers. Forrest Gump couldn't stand to die. He carried them out one by one, until we finally found Barb. He was so badly wounded that he was breathing. But Forrest Gump still risked his life to take him off the battlefield. Barb finally said something about wanting to go home. He died in Forrest Gump's arms. Watching his friends die, Forrest Gump is heartbroken. Forrest Gump landed in a military hospital with a bullet in his ass. Here he met the platoon leader he had rescued. By this time, both of his legs had been amputated. Lying in bed, his eyes were dull and lifeless. He would rather die in battle than do so. Forrest Gump because of heroic rescue deeds. Received the Medal of Honor from the President. Even spoke in front of the White House as a soldier's representative. Forrest Gump's soldier days aren't over yet. Another opportunity found him. In the hospital Forrest Gump learned to play table tennis. He didn't think he had a talent for it. The army drafted him into the United States table tennis team. It has also boosted diplomacy between China and the United States. A few years later Forrest Gump reached the age of retirement. His career as a soldier and his career in ping pong ended at the same time. His various endorsements in ping pong have earned him a lot of money. Idle Forrest Gump thought of his friend Babu. He came to Babu's hometown to visit his mother. And he used all his savings to buy a shrimp boat. He decided to grant his friend's wish. However, only one shrimp was caught in the first catch. That day wants the old platoon leader to find Forrest Gump. He's here to make good on his promise. The platoon commander laughed at Forrest Gump. He'll be a sailor himself if he can be a captain. Although with the help of the platoon commander. But neither of them knew anything about shrimping. The only commendable thing is that. They go out to sea every day. Never give up because of difficulties. One day a typhoon came ashore. The ships hiding in the harbor are broken. But in the sea Forrest Gump escaped the disaster. 
suddenly there was no pure competition, they catch more and more shrimp. With the increasing number of orders, Forrest bought 12 more boats to expand production. It later became the famous company Babuken, the owner of a shrimping company, and set up their own warehouse and logistics, became a low-key millionaire. At this moment, the platoon leader finally said what had been buried in his heart for many years. Saving my life, maybe it was Forrest Gump, long understood the meaning of life, just when things were getting better. Home suddenly came the bad news Aga mother seriously ill. Forrest Gump rushed back to his hometown overnight. Looking at the mother on the bed, Forrest Gump was at a loss. The thought that my mother might leave me. His heart was filled with fear. Dan wants to know his fate too. His mother told him that he had to find his own destiny. Life is like a box of chocolates. You never know what you're gonna get. After I sent my mother away, Forrest Gump gave the company to the platoon leader. The platoon leader bought stock in a fruit company for him. Forrest Gump didn't expect to make so much money selling fruit, but he still remembered what his mother had said. You don't need much money, 